Hello everyone and you're very welcome to my channel and a happy new year to all of you and I hope you're all uh, started this new year of 2021 in good spirits. Um, I'm going to show you today uh, how to remove unwanted sounds and breaths from your recording in Audacity which can be really important actually it's vital in voiceover and uh, you know uh, not not just not just the breath, like I said, but unwanted sounds, things that that creep into your recording uh, on Audacity that are that you really don't need or you don't want, and uh, it will it will make everything sound a whole lot better. And this is really important to know. It took me a while uh, when I started off because I actually didn't have this booth when I started off doing voiceovers. I had a homemade fort, a hobo fort, in my attic uh, using made from pallets and old foam from an old couch, which worked quite well for, for a while, it did. But, uh, you know, as you can see, I've upgraded a wee bit now. Uh, right, so we'll just, we'll crack on and I'm gonna show you exactly what I mean here. So we'll head over to Audacity. It should be at Audacity, as you can see. We're at uh, Audacity now. Okay, and as always, with every single recording, I'll always leave the first five seconds silent uh, for noise reduction purposes. And if you don't know this already, I'll just quickly show you. So the first five seconds I'll record in silence. Okay. And now I'll actually start recording myself. <clears throat> Here we go. This is a place where dragons roam the sky, where ghouls and goblins roam the air. I have been casting spells for centuries, and I will, of course, cast one for you. Okay, had a wee bit of fun. Uh, so I'll stop that there now. Now I'll go back to my uh, first five seconds. So I'm just going to highlight that here. As you can see, I'll press effect, click on effect. And I'm going to go to noise reduction. Uh, make sure everything is similar to this or the same. So the noise reduction is at 12. The sensitivity is at 6. The frequency smoothing band is at 3. And your noise is at reduce. And click on get noise profile. Now what you want to do after this is, is pretty simple. Just press um, select for the whole file. Highlight the whole file. Go back to effect. Go back to noise reduction again and just press OK. And basically what that's done is it's removed all the unwanted noise um, that was in your voiceover from the start. So now we're going to go on to removing our sounds and our breaths that we don't want. So I'll just, I'll just remove this bit here. Just click it out. I'm going to change the waveform so you can see the breaths and the unwanted noises a lot easier. Uh, so I'll just... Go down here to waveform db. Right, so these things here are clearly the breaths. I'll just make this bigger so you can see it. I can even zoom in a wee bit. Right, so th these are the these are the unwanted breaths here. And these are all words as you can see. So you might want to reduce them, remove them, it might be another sound. So quite simply, I'm just going to highlight it here. And I go up to effect and I click on amplify. Now I'll just bring it just down past the center to around minus four or five there, as you can see. Uh, press OK. As you can see, that's made it smaller. So we, we want to do it again. Now, there's no need to keep going back to Amplify and doing it again. If it's, you can just go to Repeat Amplify and Repeat Amplify. As you can see, it's a lot smaller there. And do it again and again. I mean, you can, if it's something that you don't want to remove all the way, like I said, you can just click once or twice, or you, you can, you know, play around with it a wee bit, play around with it. So this is a bigger one here, as you can see, a bigger breath is a huge one. So repeat, amplify, repeat, repeat, keep clicking on repeat. Right, okay. There's also another option, um, which I'll show you in a second, but just, I could have just removed those words there, removed those breaths by clicking the scissors, but that would have left the words um, too close together and it would sound very terrible actually. So it's really important that it has that natural sound uh, when you're recording and you know this gives you the opportunity to do that. Also, we'll just carry on, it's a big one here. 
another option, what you can also do is go back up to effect, go back to amplify this time, and just bring it down a long way to about 30%. And I'd say press OK. As you can see, it's removed the entire the entire breath. And this also works with any unwanted noises or clicks. Like as you can see there, that's me probably messing around. Uh, I'll just do that right up to here, as you can see, and just press effect, repeat, amplify, and there you go. And that's removed basically all the you know the breaths and the unwanted sounds. And I really hope this helps you out, folks. And uh, I, I hope it will, especially if you're starting off in voiceover and you're wondering how do I get rid of those unwanted sounds or unwanted breaths, you know, that, um, yeah, that, that will hamper your, your voiceover. Uh, any questions at all or if, if it works for you, if it doesn't, just uh, stick a comment in the comment section and let me know and I'll get back to you straight away. I'm glad to help. And, and you know, I'm, I'm very uh, new enough to the voiceover world, but any information I have, I'm, I'm glad to pass on. I'm also glad to learn. So if you've got something you want to teach me, also stick it in the comment section. So um, happy new year, folks, and uh, happy voiceovers. Hey, you. Yeah, I'm talking to you. If you're looking for a voice actor, you came to the right place, my friend. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Otherwise, you're going to end up with the Gambino crew and sleeping with the fishes. Capiche?